NBA fans, the wait is over and basketball is back with DraftKings Sportsbook. What better place than to place your bets with the official sportsbook of the NBA, DraftKings? Look, we got the promo going right now. New customers can get $150 instantly for new subscribers. For you to place them bets, all you got to do is throw $5 down, win, lose, or draw. It don't matter because it ain't your money no way. You can get straight to it, do your parlays, single game, multi-game, whatever you want to do. All you have to do is place $5 down, use promo code CLUB520. Look, man, basketball is way more fun when you're in on the action. Make sure you download the DraftKings app so you can get started today. Make sure you use that code, CLUB520. Make sure you use CLUB520 as a promo code only on DraftKings Sportsbook. With the official sportsbook of the NBA, DraftKings. Because the crown is yours. All right, hey, look, if you want to hear the greatest parts of this episode, tap into the Patreon. We get it cracking off the right way. But you know what I'm saying? We back. 100K episode. It's the 100K episode with my dogs, Club 520 Podcast. I'm the host. My name is DJ Wells. To my left, I got my dog, Bishop, out the prelies. My nigga be here. How you what? Love, bro. Shout out to all the supporters. We reached 100K. I think we a little past 100. We had like 110 now. Man, we got 110. Yeah, Shout out to everybody, man, that fuck with us. I know what really did it. We don't got to tap into it, but yeah. <laughs> One of our previous episodes got us lit and got us popping on the internet. Shout out to all the blogs that showed us love. We don't want to shout all y'all out, but... But I, shout out to y'all. Yeah. Shout out to y'all. You know what I'm saying? My yeah. dog, still to my right, young Nacho, young Tig. How you what, man? It's been a stressful week, man. <laughs> it's been a week, man. It's been too long. <laughs> nah, but I'm so happy we got this 100K, man. The fans showing love, the supporters, the subscribers, all that good stuff, man. Uh, let's just keep going, keep making good content, bro. For sure, for sure. Appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? We, we, I think we all murdered out today on accident, but I appreciate yeah. the energy. You know what I'm saying? Nah, yeah, I was on B hand time. These like the new forces right here. Well, then I'm, I'm like, like I, yeah, I might wear these every day. Them look like the ones the DJ showed us back in the day. The white cats. <laughs> ah, say, okay, them the for real ones. <laughs> I, <laughs> so, our people on the Gadiz and the DJ don't sell fake shoes. So, that's what he's trying to say. Our <laughs> people, the 6'5 guy, he's a, My nigga I had a, a pair of them. He was a shoe man. Yeah. Yeah. Out of the if GMC you call shoes. Them shits want shoes. <laughs> I had to see what bro told looking like Paul's on this shit. That's crazy. <laughs> See, hey, yo, he's out of pocket, bro. See what bro Tug look like is wild, bro. But that is see, crazy. That's crazy. Bro, that's how you knew if the shoe was real. The funny go. shit is getting the fake shoe and the shoe to come out is always funny because nigga, oh, you got them. And they go look at your shit hard and yeah, tell bro, like, damn. I used to hate niggas. I remember when the goddamn Cherry uh, 14s came out. I'm like, why the fuck would you go to Pendlers knowing everybody at the school got the real ones? Why would you even match them up with our shit, bro? Yeah, I had some fake tens. Red and white tins, but they was terrible. Crazy, bro. Yeah, that's what so far. What we doing, bro? Uh, trip. Shout out. Well, we used to fuck pellets up back in the day. Oh, God. I mean, that's how it was. The real nice kicks, you know what I'm saying, was the fake site back in the day. Mm-hmm. Niggas, niggas was tapped in. Facts. Was there any shoe sites like that, though? Like, can you buy, like, remix shoes still to this day? Hell yeah, nigga. I, I, if you ever look on the internet now, and if you go look at all, like, dunks, like, older dunks, or, like, Travis Scott's with a whole bunch of people who got them, most of the time they fake. Yeah. Because I've been seeing niggas with crazy SB dunks. Like, I know they're not real, bro. Yeah, and people like, people like rocking with the fake dunks, though. That's like, the shit not, now. Yeah, I was like, it ain't like frowned upon. Like, people like, Oh, I genuinely uh, didn't know that it was a site that you can go buy some, some bullshit yeah, on. I ain't never bought no fake. I, I got some fake Yeezys. But, <laughs> but that wasn't on purpose, know. though. That wasn't on purpose, nah. Shout out to the Red October. Yeah. yeah. That was orange. <laughs> Man, them shit was orange, damn <laughs> it. That nigga, look at that shoe car, that nigga said. Hey, bro, them shit is fake. How much they run you, though? 2500 Woo. For the fakes? For the fakes, nigga. Didn't know. Damn. Who told you they was fake, PJ? I was at a shoe, uh, like a shoe con, whatever, and I'm up in the uh, and I had pulled them out, pause, and I'm like, the nigga was like, you might want to put them up. <laughs> Oh, you might put them up See, what niggas don't know is on Damn. that easy too. When you open that strap, it's shit on there. Yeah. But it's real particular. Like, you know how you can't fake certain details and shoes and shit? Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's one of them you can't go away from. Damn, uh, niggas yeah. still, but I knew niggas with the fake designer shoes. I know that's still a thing. Oh, niggas be dripped out in the fake designer. Yeah, and Tiff put me on to like certain sites and shit. But nigga, I, go I'm to like, Atlanta, boy. They got everything you need. I seen a nigga with a Gucci thermal. I had never seen a Gucci <laughs> thermal in my life. Yeah. Them was the wildest thing. Niggas had them Gucci velour outfits at Pipe. Oh, the tracksuits. Wow. Oh, my goodness. I'm like, bro. Oh, uh, they had money. 
No, they didn't. No, nah, they, they didn't. The Gucci, of- Gucci Valor is crazy. Yeah. We had the South Pole, the South Hey, niggas had. Fat Farm. <laughs> Like, niggas didn't have no Gucci at Ripple. I swear, bro. they had Gucci. They didn't either. Y'all was different. <laughs> they didn't have Gucci either. <laughs> no, nah, that's it. That's it. They said something else for that motherfucker, but it had G's on there. That G was lowercase than <laughs> the motherfucker. <laughs> it's it definitely said some other shit. <laughs> but, but, nah. that, but that's a big thing now, though. And that's why, like, if you look at the sneaker resale market, a lot of shit been diving because it's a lot of generation of people now that just, like, Shit, they ain't gonna know the difference. Fact. Fuck it. I paid 200 for the fake before I paid 1500 for this motherfucking resale on StockX. Yeah. That's crazy. And if you ain't getting across the people who really know that shit, shit, you getting it all. Yeah, because I know my niggas was getting all motherfuckers for them uh, DR1s. Out of pocket. Yeah. We, we know a nigga. I got a homeboy <laughs> out of pocket. <laughs> we got a homeboy out of pocket, bro. I definitely out of pocket. Yeah, I, I said, hey, man. I said, oh, nigga, nigga is in the gym with the DR1. <laughs> you got butt. <laughs> nigga, hey, I say, I don't, I don't have those. <laughs> Jeff was low key, hey, yeah, I was. I was I like, don't even, you know, I mean, I don't be on there. He like, I mean, here, look, I said, bro, because I, I wasn't paying no attention. I said, nah, he wearing them too recklessly. <laughs> Did you see the laces? That's what bro, got me. Nah, what? we just saw the side of them hole. Yeah, I said, nah, he played. <laughs> nah, nah for he got to be playing. The screen print, yours. Yeah, hey, shout out to him, man. <laughs> Cause I be I'm so tapped out of that shit. Cause I'm like, nigga, if you got a fake like Gucci fit or something, how can somebody really tell, bro? Especially if you got a duplicate. Cause niggas ain't checking the tags. Now let's throw some bullshit in the game. Now niggas definitely get caught off of fake shoes, but we definitely don't say nothing to women who got fake purses. Now oh, you probably sure. don't they know, it up. but they oh, that's yeah. the part of, they that's regular. Yeah, I went to China. When we went to China. Never mind. I ain't never mind. Nope, I ain't doing it. Oh, they ain't gonna run you out, bro. They know they got the... All right, I'm gonna do it. It's yeah, funny they got the hell. remix. This is how, this how I knew rich people crazy, bro. So the richest person on our team was well, the owner. He's a rich... Yeah. His wife went and bought a whole Louis Vuitton fake set. <laughs> I said, no, the fuck she did. And she did. Yeah. It was they was buying so much fake shit in China. One time, one of the girls... I don't remember who girlfriend it was. She bought a YSL bag, but it said Y-A-L. Wow. So it, it, it said Y8L <laughs> instead of the S. It, like, it was an 8. Oh, hey, the number. Yeah. And but P was like, hey, you, you can't you wild with this one. <laughs> she was like, it looks that bad. Hey, look, baby girl, it's an 8. It ain't even an S on there. <laughs> she should have been brought up on the charges when YSL got arrested. <laughs> that shit had an 8, bro. I was like, this is crazy. Damn. The Kobe YSL is nuts. But to see the owner's wife, bro, he a billionaire. She had a whole Louis Vuitton. She had the fleet. She had the fucking big ass duffel with the suitcase with the. Uh, oh, she got the Christmas kids. She got, oh, yeah. she she got the matching set. Nigga, all of it. Well, I mean, who was going to say something to them, though? That, that I think mean, that's what, why they. That's what I said. I was like, who going to tell her it's fake? Because I'm papered up. Yeah. I'm a billionaire. And that's why we be behind the A ball. And that's because... why I told P, load up. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, hell no. <laughs> I'll be the one to get called out. I'll get caught. Like, shit. That's the fucked up part about it. Yeah. Is you can get it off, but that moment you get caught, caught it's going to be it's spooky. Because the whole team, we all bought Rolexes. Like, everybody bought Rolexes. Yeah. I said, I can't do it, y'all. <laughs> y'all from that, dog. The moment I get called out, bro. You going to be tight. I'm going to be tight, bro. Like, you going to be pissed. I, I ain't do it like y'all, bro. Y'all yeah. don't care. I care, bro. He's going to be different. I'll sign the about a real one. Don't get it fucked up. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> you can check my stats. Oh, boy, trying to play you, put you in the eight mile uh, the TikTok. Boy, they, they didn't caught you with a fake watch. That'd have been. That zoom in would have been so crazy. I ain't going to get that nigga no love for that TikTok. It was funny, but fuck him. <laughs> nigga, I was not, I wasn't reposting it. Motherfuckers was sending me shit like this shit funny. Oh, you're no. tagged a lot. Nigga, I home. said, yeah, fuck him. Nigga. I won't put no laughing. I, I respond to everybody who tagged me and shit. His, fuck him. He ain't getting no. Because that story time that was crazy. <laughs> shit was funny. Talking about my journey. <laughs> Fuck him. Hey. I'm still mad about that oh, shit. shit. I knew you wouldn't know that because I didn't say, I was like, I, I said, if I'm 20 pages, you can repost too, but I'm going to just let this rock. <laughs> I ain't going to repost this. I'm going to just let this cook. I was like, fuck him. Because uh, <laughs> the first time somebody ever called me that was Dennis Ziegler, man. He called me that shit in high school. He said, hey, man, you look like that nigga off of Antoine Fisher. 
<laughs> said, nigga, what? And hey, that's a wild movie. Yeah, I was, like, I was like, who the fuck's up, Antoine Fisher? <laughs> and it was that nigga. Yeah. Was, I was like, y'all got me fucked up. All right, peace to that nigga. Yeah, he passed in. Yeah, yeah, they got me fucked. Now nah, they try to kill me off. That's okay. crazy. Damn. So if your girl bought you something fake for Christmas, and you didn't know, but you found out about one of your niggas, are you tight? I'm doing it like Frank Lucas did that fur after he came back home from the indictment after the fight. <laughs> Fucking playing in my face. <laughs> I'm gonna fake pay this rent. <laughs> Niggas be excited for them Christmas gifts. Cause you imagine going crazy what's, like what's the best Christmas gift you, gift you ever got? Like a girl got you. Uh <laughs> that's a good question. Pay my car note. Damn. Damn. She really when? when I had my uh when I had my three hundred, motherfucker paid two months for me. Damn. Damn two? Yeah, oh, when, trying- I, when I had the one back at Butler, the black one. What's yeah. the best you got? Damn, I was gonna say, I right, not no fucking car. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little shitty now. I got some yeah. fire shoes before, but shit, I'm out of pocket now. if I shout her out. That's out of pocket. Yeah, for sure. Pocket, I went out. I went out. I, 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 I really was about to be like, <laughs> it was gonna be Jeff's turn, yeah, but he just like, can't say it. Yeah, I was like, ah, shit. Nah, we ain't doing that. Respects. Uh, best gift I got. Pete bought me a four wheeler. Ah, yeah. Yeah. That's fun. That's yeah. hard. That's crazy. Cause when you go to the comparison with gifts, it always gets spooky. Yeah. yeah. I, I, that is spooky, but that like I that I was tight, bro. A four wheeler, yeah. like what four wheeler is hard. That's, I was, that's elite. I was yeah, yeah, I was like, damn. <clears throat> what what do I gotta get now? <laughs> fuck. You know what I'm saying? I was like, fuck, you bought a four wheeler? Fuck, I gotta get a car. Fuck yeah. <laughs> what was yours, bro? Oh, I got some heat before. I, I've got, I've had some nice heat on the Christmas tree before. So yeah. I definitely wouldn't have paid for. Shout out to StockX. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't be expecting the gifts though. I just kind of, I'm just. A, you don't like? Would you? You wouldn't be mad if your girl ain't get you a gift for Christmas, like your wife? Hell no. Nah. I'm shitty. Yeah, I'm tired. If I come down that tree and ain't nothing down there with my name on that motherfucker. I'm tired. For oh, real? Well, Hell yeah. That's it too. It could be something simple. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Nigga, you could just give me a memory card or something. Nah, I wouldn't give a fuck, but it better be something down there with my name on it. <laughs> Absolutely. Nah, bro. I, I just cause I think that just the gifts, like I don't mind getting the motherfucker something, but for me, bro, I just nah. Cause I'm so picky too. It's just like I was gonna say you just particular. That's why you like that. Yeah, but I just don't be feeling like a motherfucker gotta give me nothing. Cause I feel like there's just too much pressure. Don't give me nothing. I don't know holidays. I'm straight, bro. I feel cause that. I don't wanna think about it too much. Like for a nigga. I can't imagine waking up on Christmas and not seeing my name on a gift and being shitty because I'm low-key tight the the rest of the day, that year. Oh, yeah, I might not I, talk to you yeah. until... Yeah, I'm tight. We're bringing in the new when, year. When's your birthday again? <laughs> Ooh, it better not be before mine. <laughs> yeah. It better not be before mine. Yeah, See, yeah, my birthday, November 30th, then you got Christmas, then it's like, don't even worry about it. I'm nah, good. Don't worry about it with me. <laughs> <laughs> it's up. Okay, so no since gift. y'all since y'all tripping about it, what a motherfucker got to get you price wise? Is no, it a I price? Don't I, don't I don't give a shit. Don't oh, don't okay. It can well, be a Nike it's... hoodie, but tap in. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just right. make sure some. I ain't gonna lie. I do care a little bit. That's what I'm saying. They gotta, they gotta be five hundred up with me, bro. Oh, right? Cause well, my gift's gonna be five hundred or more. That's fair. But that, that's not why you give though, bro. Listen, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's not why you give though, Nasty. You supposed to just give uh, from your if heart. If you bring bro. something for a hundred dollars to your girl, she gonna be like, "Damn, you ain't put no effort in this." Oh, nigga, for the hundred, and if it's, it's special, what's, what's special? special? They gonna say what's special for us hundred dollars? Nah, bro, y'all, y'all now y'all wild. You might write a letter or some shit, but I wish you would Hallmark Christmas. This is from the heart, <laughs> nigga. You, your heart gonna be fucked up that whole day. <laughs> That's because that's why I be that's why I be done with your ass. <laughs> Shit like this, like damn, baby, I wrote you a card. Well, see, that's why y'all be y'all out of pocket because y'all automatically putting a dollar amount on it, bro. Yeah, I am. Like you are uh, spending a hundred dollars on your girl for Christmas, bro. It should be cool, like nah, it's disrespectful. Because if y'all spend, if she spend fifty on you, it shouldn't matter. What I'm gonna give with fifty? Yes, are we I going to fill something? my tank up for fifty? I'm saying her gift don't always have to equally match yours yeah, price wise. I'm giving y'all a <laughs> random number, bro. Yeah, fuck it. Fuck if you spend if you spend a G on your girl, bro, she don't gotta spend a G. She could spend two fifty. Close. She could spend buy you some shoes. Probably you want some shoes that cost four hundred. She better get close. If I spend a thousand, you better spend six fifty. <laughs> I better look like yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, you went to work for this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Jay was like, well, shit, it costs a thousand, but if she bought it on sale, so it's cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's, that's how I go. Because if you buy a Louis bag and get a pair of forces for Christmas, you tight. Come on, bro. You bring me a polo t shirt, I bought you a Louis bag. <laughs> that's, nigga, that's extreme. <laughs> that's what girls be doing, nigga. That's you extreme. know, you love polo tees. I you, got you some. You polo. wore this on our first date, and I saw this. <laughs> Fuck that story. Go back. He got, he got trauma. Oh, no, I've had some great Christmases. Respects. <laughs> but also, I've seen some bullshit. I, I miss running your Apollo T and you spit the man. I'm going to tell you, swing on. Because I'm mad for you. That's the shit. Swing and miss, though. <laughs> swing and miss, but. No, that's what no, be no, in the long house. I'm going to keep it a review with you. Somebody did that to me before, bro. Offer? Bro. This is the proudest Christmas gift I ever got. I spent a nice amount of money on Christmas for somebody. Yeah. Since when I was younger, I spent probably like maybe like five to seven thousand, right? Mm. I went all out. I'm like, hey, couple bags, whatever. They gave me an iPhone. <laughs> I already had a new iPhone. They got me an iPhone and put pictures of themselves in. Hard. That shit was, I was so mad. And it was I probably was, jailbroken. I was living. <laughs> I got a question. I'm not trying to fuck up the story. Was the iPhone older than the one that you already had? It was a second. It was, it was a, uh, it was a, like an eight. That motherfucker was a seven. I was, I, I said, she said, I know you wanted a new phone. Nigga, I already got a new phone. She said, just look at the inside. <laughs> <laughs> you spent a lot of fucking 7,000. Mm-hmm. I got iPhone. a new, I got an iPhone. That shot was crazy. <laughs> I don't really, it was so long ago. I don't really care. I'm just saying, like that was Diesel. <laughs> what is he on? <laughs> what is he on, bro? <laughs> Man, what is he on, bro? <laughs> Be here, came to pot today. Yeah, what is he on, bro? That was Diesel. I, I was so I young too. No I think diesel. I was like 23 or some shit. She was trying to get back. Oh, yeah, I ain't had no Diesel. <laughs> <laughs> when she gave me that iPhone, bro, I, I lost it. Hey, that's, yo. A diff- that's a different pump at the gas station. <laughs> no, for real. That's a different price at the gas station. Hey, hey, that boy, my nigga had that tank. <laughs> He's a fucking clown. Man. Hey, man, shout out to my cousin who fucked up the family vacation because he put diesel fuel in the car in the rental. <laughs> Niggas did not go to Florida. We were stuck on the west side. My that, uncle was so shit. That jokes hurt. <laughs> that nigga put diesel in a regular yes, car. He's trying to blow off. <laughs> hey, shut up, fucking kill you. Shout out to my cousin, man. He did not want to go to Disney World, apparently. Because <laughs> we didn't go. Driving to Disney World is nuts. <laughs> yeah, I was out of pocket. <laughs> out of fucking pocket. That was God's out out We did that when I was in fourth grade, bro. That was the longest trip ever, bro. 28 hours or some shit. Nigga, feel uh, like it. When we was at Butler, we used to always do this little rehab program that we used to go down there and do the houses and shit right before Thanksgiving. It was a fire ass trip. They let us down there for four days, had money, do whatever you want to. That's the longest bus ride I ever had in my life, bro. That's crazy. Bro. I done had some long bus rides, though. Shout out to my nigga Shell. We drove to the final four. Hmm. Shout out to my nigga Keenan. We drove to Miami. Yeah, I did. That was out of pocket. We pit stopped at Brody Creek. Yeah, I did. I was like, these niggas is tripping. Oh, y'all yeah, kicked it there as a pit stop? Mm-hmm. We drove at ours and woke up the next day and finished the route. Went to South Beach. Tell them what happened. Oh, y'all, oh, y'all tripped there. Oh, we had fun. <laughs> Tell them what happened. So, How was story your time would be here. <laughs> so, There's your camera. How was your commute? It's off. <laughs> My good fix again. Hey, what, what the cop tell you? Uh, what you say? Somebody be a real nigga. What the cop tell you? Yeah, I like that. Somebody be a real one. these niggas. I said, bitch, if I go to jail for some paraphernalia, what do y'all be ten six minutes say so? <laughs> The cops in. <laughs> they, they got us. We out. Come on. Hey, come on. The tree. They got us. Bro. He's calf. <laughs> These cat, these niggas is goddamn shaking in their boots. I'm like, bitch, we not going to jail. He already told us we ain't going to jail. Who reefer is it? They already found it. He said, I, I know it's weed. Da, da, da. I'm like, he pulled it out. I ain't gonna say who yep. put it behind my seat. I still want to kick your little light skin ass today. <laughs> but I swear to God, if we would went to jail, it'd have been on. You with the no look, but they let us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nah, for sure. He hit you with the magic. Hey, them niggas call me, bro. I'm, on the, I'm crying on the phone, yeah, bro. Yeah, they let us go. Oh, man, that shit was funny as hell. Nah, but they let us go home. Shout out to my niggas. Man. That's funny, man. Yeah. Shout out to the road trips. Hey, man. Basketball been crazy so far this year. All the niggas who got max deals really going crazy so far. Mm-hmm. Shout out to AE. 
Shout out to LaMelo. Tyrese. Hey, I want to talk about it. I love Burton. He's the best point guard in the NBA right now. He's having the best season this year as a point guard, for sure. Mm. I'm not going to say he's better than Steph. I'm not going to say he's better than Dane. But as far as who's having the best season so far at that PG position, Tyrese Halliburton is that nigga. So is he an NBA all-star starter? I, he won't get no votes. Mm. Oh, he should be, because okay. I mean, we in the city, but he won't get no votes. But yeah. I think he'll be an all-NBA player this year. Yeah, he balling. Yeah, he's nice. they scoring a lot of fucking points. Boy, 150 and shit, that shit is crazy. Because we don't play a lick of defense. Uh, I love it. I wish I was part of this league. No defense, <laughs> just scoring. This yeah. is like... Shout out to Pike. Yeah, fuck. I shouldn't say that out loud, because <laughs> that's the fuck we do. <laughs> And without we can't the, even score. Without the score. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Coach. We play no defense and can't score. All right. Never mind. You need, a, you need a Halliburton on your team. It's okay. Yeah, oh, he got oh, shit. <laughs> he got heat snow. <laughs> but yeah. He's the middle of all. He's probably the stick of man. <laughs> he said, I got Eric Snow. That's crazy. Nah, shout out to my young niggas, man. They going to get it together. But for real, out of those three, uh, even you can ask some other younger players in that. If you had to start a franchise, who's one of them y'all, y'all starting with? Oh. Hey. Yeah. hey so, Anthony Edwards out the gate? Yeah, hey, Eddie. No, I'm going to go with uh, Jason Tatum. JT? Or he too old? He too old, I was bro. like, he too old for that. Because they all, what, 21, 22? So, Luca too old, too? Uh, he like I wouldn't 24. put him in that conversation. I'd probably put so, somebody a little bit younger. This uh, dude's a uh, couple year players. Like, niggas that only been two or three years. All right, I'll go with... Uh... <laughs> but obviously, them two niggas yeah. are definitely... And he's a Charlotte Hornet type of nigga. I'm surprised right. you didn't say Melo. Anthony Edwards. Yeah, yeah. I think I ain't cold as fuck. Yeah. Yeah, I remember when we had this... Look, y'all always want to point out the wrong shit. When we told y'all how cold that nigga was... Boy, oh, yeah. Star. Niggas don't oh, want to no. show more love now. Like, yeah, oh, no, y'all, 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 y'all out of pocket. My yeah. nigga is definitely top five two guard in the league. Uh, and he talking sure. crazy on niggas. Like, yeah, it's, for sure. It's he not even five. close. Yeah, he like, top five for sure. Try to tell y'all, but hey, whatever. Honestly, I was there at that Pistons game last week, bro. And I heard the MVP chance. And for all the things that we suffered, I was like, damn, we finally got a nigga on our team that's really cold again. Cause nah. that nigga Tyrese Halliburton is different, bro. Yeah, he really cold. Bro. He's really different. Y'all deserve it. We and his and his shot is his shot is ugly than a bitch, but he that got a sprayer. And much <laughs> sprayer, bro. Unorthodox and a motherfucker. Yeah, his sprayer is nuts, though. Yeah, that's crazy. That, <laughs> well, sprayer. Yeah, that's what I call my shit. My bad. <laughs> my bad. T A. He probably he probably don't know nothing about none of that. <laughs> 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 And he got a sprayer. God, <laughs> that is wild. That's wild. That shit come up between my legs. Hey, all, my right. Legs. all right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we are not on Patreon hey, no y'all more. Y'all remember the water guns <laughs> they used to carry with the backpack? <laughs> <laughs> when you get that last little bit out, that's how I feel. <laughs> what the fuck come up to my legs? Nigga? All right, Bishop Giddy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you out of pocket. Damn. You this out of pocket. Or Giddy. <laughs> that nigga so out of pocket, what bro. What was he on? What was he like, 14, 15? Bro. Oh, y'all got that one. <laughs> Did you see the, com- the company uh, from overseas? They was like, they're about to revoke his uh, his, uh, his uh, sponsorship. They should. Bro. How's <laughs> he still playing? Bro, listen, I understand how niggas feel about job, but they've been saying this on the internet and it's facts, bro. All Ja did was flick the blicky, bro. This nigga is out here posted up with the selfies and they letting that ride, bro. Bro, oh, she yeah. how old? Bro, she's 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 so she's she a minor. should be dating one of your teammates, your team's kids, bro. That's yeah. what they should be on, bro. Damn, she in high school. That's crazy. That's just allegations, though. So Allegedly. We yeah, we don't want none of that. No smoke, bro. No smoke. We don't want no smoke, yeah. Giddy. But Back to Tyrese Halliburton. <laughs> but that fake LeBron post is funny. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> and the caption in the video, they put H-A number and number as a music. And the nigga scored a layup. They Johnny. had that nigga coming down to R. Kelly's I Am The Greatest. <laughs> Have I'm, your, not laugh, I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing. Have your hoop mix to R. Kelly is flagrant. I'm not laughing, bro. I'm not laughing. That's a wild. That's a wild intro. I'm not laughing, bro. Because the nigga who edited that, he need to be in jail too. Because he's an accomplice. That NBA Central Twitter needs to be banned, bro. Hey, get, that, get, these niggas are crazy. Get your they, mental right, Josh, man. Get your right. No, Josh, you're going to jail. <laughs> If this is true, bitch, you're going to jail. John Morant got to sit out because he's fucking playing with a lighter in the car. <laughs> you out here motherfucking hooping off the court on these bro. kids, bro? Absolutely not, yeah, bro. bro. Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly. Allegedly. But I'm just saying, like, he should at least until they figure out what's he going on. He should not be playing, He should be bro. sitting down. 
All jokes aside, until they figure out what's really going on, he needs to be seated, bro. And what's crazy is all the Josh niggas wild in him, Josh Primo, all y'all niggas named Josh, y'all, y'all under watch. We got to see what y'all niggas is on, because y'all be chilling. That's a weak-ass name anyway, because your real name is Joshua. <laughs> Bible names is crazy, though. I was almost named Ezekiel. That's weak as hell. I yeah. see it. Ezekiel Elliott. Y'all be on the same type of shit. <laughs> and they call me Easy. <laughs> easy. <laughs> Hey, remember he did it to pray. You don't want to be easy. Oh, God. What pray? Which one? Zeke got to pray. Was that the one that... Oh, no, not that pray. No. <laughs> no, bro. Hey, do hey, don't do my thing. <laughs> hey, what pray? <laughs> what pray you talking about, man? The one Aaron Hall was performing at? <laughs> Where the niggas was doing cartwheels with, with snow cones in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> Why you say Errol? Errol. Hey, hey R.I.P. R.I.P. Luther Vedros. They said he still got the first one in 1984. <laughs> the pioneer, respect it. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done, I'm done bro. Luther got it. Luther got it. Cracking in 84. <laughs> Yo, man, bro, I'm out, bro. I'm out. It's an Aaron Hall. Because if it did, he wild. They wildin', bro. But that picture of them hugging bro, is crazy. Wildin', bro. Hey, yo. <laughs> and nigga said, I was putting in work. Ask Diddy. <laughs> nigga, no. I'm not yo, asking another man, nigga about what you want. Bro, uh, that was, they said, them niggas see me. They see me going to work. I said, man, what are they doing? That nigga put in the work site. He said, yeah, ask Diddy. Ask this nigga. They see me work, man, bro. That's I said, crazy. what are y'all doing, bro? They out of pocket, uh, bro. Man. Oh, y'all shit. crazy. <laughs> Oh, that's crazy, oh it's, it's, hey, bro, the allegation list is growing, bro. Bro, that it is, is, bro. The allegation bro. list is growing, bro. Yeah, this is going to make it to YouTube. We Gucci, man. We ain't say nothing out of pocket. This but, is safe. Uh, on a lighter note, hey, that nigga CM Punk. Oh, that was hard. Hey, he had a top five wrestling moment, bro. Oh, on God, bro. That's, my, that's probably the best. That's the top that's five number wrestling three. That's number three. And Triple H is a real one for that. Yeah. John Cena coming back was one, was one of the top ones at WrestleMania. Yeah. But that right there, that was hard. No, they about to, they for real about to shake that whole roster up. Yeah. They real, really pissed sure. off so many people in there with that move. And that's crazy. And he came back in Chicago. That shit was rocking. I ain't gonna lie. I was watching that shit. I low-key got chills. Pete called me weird for that. <laughs> yeah, getting chills watching when niggas tangle up is wild. Bro, he wasn't even wrestling, bro. He wasn't wrestling, bro. He wasn't wrestling, bro. See, this nigga, hey, what he <laughs> on today, bro? I'm just saying. They wasn't wrestling, bro. He hey, just walked out, bro. I, I got chills watching Lex Luger slam Hulk Hogan. <laughs> Please don't say Lex Luger. Because <laughs> he was slamming outside the ring. <laughs> Damn. Lex Luger got a crack it too. Yeah, he's out of pocket. <laughs> and Hulk Hogan called us niggas. <laughs> yeah, Hulk definitely called us niggas. Did he? Yeah, bro. Oh, my God. He hates us. <laughs> I did, hey, what's crazy is he been tan so long, niggas don't know what his identity is. So it was like, I don't know if I should be offended or not, niggas. We don't know what you are. Niggas did think he was light skinned. That's crazy. He is there the DJ Khaled color. <laughs> he was the first one. I'm not black, I'm Dominican. That's fucked up. Dude. Fuck Hulk Hogan, man. The pool boy is crashing his wife. He start hating niggas. That's crazy. Ah, right, bro, fuck it. That's funny, that bitch. <laughs> But also, oh, real shit, kids will never know. Like growing up, wrestling was the shit. It was. It was, bro. But it once was. you got a certain age, you was out of pocket for watching wrestling. All right, I'm out of pocket then. I, I fucked with wrestling. Shout out to my dog Rosenberg, man. We, shout out to Rose. We was hyper that. But yeah. yeah. Nah, hell yeah, that was hard. Definitely shout out to Rosenberg, bro. Yeah. We sure. love to have you on the show. For sure. That wrestling shit, now I'm thinking about it like <clears throat> niggas used to link up for the pay per views and shit. But yeah. before we get about who your favorite wrestler, like who's swaggy wrestler you fuck with? He really was swaggy. The nigga that favored Jeff is Booker T. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of my... He's one of the ghosts. Because he still don't be yeah, We're we coming for you, we nigga. him at Halloween, bro. You be the brother, <laughs> I'll be Booker T. <laughs> Fuck it. We ain't even got a high Halloween. Just a costume party, nigga. Me nah. and Trevor Wrestles. I know what a couple of you, my female friends, can be, too. Ooh. But I'll text y'all. <laughs> tell, tell, tell me. We got a few Mark Henry's. <laughs> a few Dudley brothers. <laughs> <laughs> and a few Ray Mysterio's for shit show. <laughs> the whole thing like Ray Mysterio is crazy. The whole thing like Mark Henry, bro. No, for sure. And just got the build. 
<laughs> they got the leotard on fashion though, right shout now. Out to all my ladies oh, wearing the one piece. They got the build. Oh That's shit! Right. That's a wild two K build. <laughs> but the, the, the Mark Henry build is nasty, bro. Shout out to Mark Henry, bro. But the the <laughs> game slide is off seventy. What? He's not dead. Damn. You have to quit killing Mark <laughs> Henry. Mark Second Harris. time you've killed him on this show, bro. Mark He's Henry chilling, is bro. well and live, bro. Sorry, bro. <laughs> Whatever your time is, just know I said it early. <laughs> I said it first. <laughs> Pre-game and the, t- the tweet is nuts. Pre-game and the death is from all, all that's out of pocket, bro. He got them in the draft already? You're a sick nigga. Oh. <laughs> nigga ready to load up the drink. But who was your favorite wrestler? Damn, I fucked the Shawn Michaels because he just pulled up and kicked niggas in the face. Oh, and this is shit. And be high as hell. Hiding the motherfucker. Yeah, he was God. cold. Yeah. I fucked with uh, Razor Ramon. Oh, yeah. Still, uh, Scott Hall. R.I.P. Probably hey. the swaggiest one. Yeah. DX is one of my favorite groups of all time, bro. Yeah. A lot of suspensions for that. <laughs> I got suspended from guy for that shit. Damn. Honestly, yeah. I know we had the snowman in high school, but the DX shit in middle school was really like the same type of vibe. Yeah, His niggas was definitely walking around doing this shit, and we yeah. was definitely out of pocket. When I told the teacher, she turned around and said, <laughs> my fuck said, Jeff told you to ask <laughs> one. I said, you bitch. <laughs> You got snitched out? Yeah, I forgot who the girl was told on me. Y'all was hot. Damn. Damn, man. That's crazy. These kids bad. Because I looked at T.I. arguing with his son at that Hawk, I mean, at that Falcons game. And I said, man, what the fuck? He said, you can't do nothing with me. I said, bro, you about to beat your son of his wild. He should have beat him up, though. Nah, he should, bro. He yeah. should. He put that nigga to full Nelson. <laughs> he, he he said how he really felt, though. He probably did really raise up with his grandma, though. Man, that nigga was, boy, man, stop it. But you in struggle. Yeah. And that's going over going over your granny house and granny so hat. Don't know about parents. A lot of rich niggas' moms still want to live in the same neighborhood they've been living and in. Going to so. your granny house and she got a mansion is. But right. the point you said, yeah, you might have been over there in yeah. the hood, but you didn't have to worry about where your food was coming nah, from. For sure, you yeah. ain't amazing. Yeah, he, he's doing a lot. He's doing a lot. Yeah. He was on TV. He Literally. said he only went over there for the show. And they sent you right. <laughs> No, that's why. <laughs> Having your son as a son as a prop is crazy. <laughs> hey, bring him in. Put him on a 10 day. Yeah. Hey, bring him in. All right. We should get three call up to you right now. Because he was Sit bad as fuck. Living with that little yeah, bastard <laughs> for 24 hours. <laughs> bitch, you only can't stand this bitch part time, but there's hella cameras in this hoe. So cut up if you want to. Bad, bro. bad as hell, man. Hey, yeah. these teachers deserve more, bro. Nah, they do, bro. These teachers deserve more, bro. They do, bro. Because I can only imagine what they on now. Them little niggas be vaping and shit. We were just telling people to suck it. They on, they on live smacking motherfuckers. They yeah. on their phones for real in school, bro. All day. It's lit. Hoods at my school. I don't know about y'all's, but hoods and goddamn phones out of pocket, bro. Out you of couldn't fucking... even wear your coat. Nah. Yeah, you couldn't do that either. Bro, well, at one point, <laughs> bef- I mean, niggas start going crazy with the fist fights. But at one point, there was nothing on you having the, the CD player or the MP3 out. Yeah. There was nothing. Put your headphones off. No, bro. I'm trying to vibe before I go to class. <laughs> yeah, we had a Nigga, you could have your shit. phone in your pocket, bro. Nah. If they seen your phone print in your pocket, they'd be like, give me that. Oh. Bro, I had a sidekick, and they was on that with me. Man, what? I remember. That's, the, that's my favorite phone. That's the best phone day, ever, bro. bro. I'm rolling. The sidekick, four sidekick LX. Sidekick's the best phone, bro. Shout out to my nigga Shout out to D-Wade. I had a D-Wade sidekick. <laughs> Go look at one on eBay right now. Please, I would like to know how much that's... Uh, I know which one you're talking about. That white and gold yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. That motherfucker probably bedazzled. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> done. <laughs> <laughs> like that. Gang shit, we out. YouTube, Patreon. Goddamn IG subscribers, Twitter subscribers, goddamn it, TikTok subscribers. We love all of y'all. No disrespect to nobody's community. We love everybody. It's just jokes. Shout out to y'all. And we out. We might be back next week. And if we are, we'll see y'all next week. For sure.